Welcome to our deep dive into the mysterious and extreme world of Antarctica. Often considered the most inhospitable place on Earth, with temperatures plunging to a staggering minus 128.6 degrees Fahrenheit, this icy continent holds secrets that are crucial to understanding our planet's past, present and future. Antarctica's discovery is a tale of bravery, curiosity and relentless exploration. For centuries, the existence of a southern landmass was speculated, driven by theories of a terra australis incognita, a hypothetical unknown southern land to balance the landmasses of the northern hemisphere. The first recorded sighting of Antarctica is often attributed to the Russian expedition, led by Fabian Gottlieb von Bellingshausen and Mikhail Lazarev, who sighted the Fimbul ice shelf in 1820. However, some reports suggest that the British seafarer Edward Bransfield might have sighted the continent's mainland earlier that same year. These early explorations, fraught with perilous seas and treacherous ice, laid the groundwork for future scientific expeditions. The initial glimpses of Antarctica's icy shores by these intrepid explorers were pivotal in unveiling one of the last uncharted places on Earth, opening the door to over two centuries of scientific discovery and exploration. Antarctica wasn't always the frozen wasteland we know today. Over 100 million years ago, it was as warm as modern-day Italy, covered in lush rainforests. However, approximately 34 million years ago, a dramatic shift occurred at the boundary of the Eocene and Oligocene epochs. This transformation from a greenhouse to an icehouse climate following the extinction of the dinosaurs is a mystery that scientists are still unraveling. Understanding this drastic climate shift is vital, as it could provide insights into the Earth's climate response to factors like orbital changes and greenhouse gas concentrations. The key to unlocking this mystery lies in studying microfossils in layers of deep sea mud which record climate changes over extended periods. Antarctica's transformation presents a paradox. During its climatic shift, the oceans warmed up, yet ice sheets formed both in Antarctica and the Arctic. This contradicts current computer simulations, which don't show ice presence in the Arctic during that period. To solve this puzzle, scientists are looking in unexpected places. Notably, the Tanzania drilling project, involving teams from around the world, is exploring cores of ancient mud in Tanzania, Africa. These cores are unique due to their detailed record of climate changes and well-preserved microfossils. This research provides a clearer picture of sea level changes and climate shifts during this period. Antarctica's ice sheets are a treasure trove of discoveries. Marine geologists like Jonathan P. Clarks are uncovering fossils that reveal the continent's past biodiversity. Using the RV Polarstern, a research icebreaker, Clarks and his team drill into the seafloor, accessing layers of 90 million year old sediment. These layers are like the pages of history and each expedition brings new discoveries. The RV Polarstern, a German icebreaker and research vessel, is an icon of polar exploration and scientific research. Operated by the Alfred Wegener Institute for Polar and Marine Research, the Polar Stern has been instrumental in advancing our understanding of the polar regions since her commissioning in 1982. The ship is specifically designed for working in the polar seas. She is equipped to break through ice as thick as three meters, making her a formidable presence in the Arctic and Antarctic waters. This capability allows scientists to access some of the most remote and inhospitable regions on Earth, conducting research that would otherwise be impossible. The Polar Stern is more than just an icebreaker. She is a floating laboratory. The vessel is outfitted with state-of-the-art research equipment and facilities, including laboratories for biological, chemical, and physical research, meteorological stations, and advanced navigation and communication systems. This makes her well-suited for a wide range of scientific activities, from studying oceanography and sea ice physics to conducting marine biology and geoscience research. Among their exciting finds are fossil roots, providing evidence of plant life close to the South Pole, which alters our understanding of the climate during the super greenhouse period. One of Antarctica's most intriguing mysteries lies beneath the Thwaites Glacier. A cave, two-thirds the size of Manhattan and about 1,000 feet tall, was discovered by NASA scientists. This immense void, once holding over 15 billion tons of ice, is growing, accelerating the melting of the ice above it. Data from Italian and German spacecraft helped reveal that the ground had shifted significantly between 1992 and 2017, indicating rapid changes in the glacier's structure. The Thwaites Glacier, responsible for roughly 4% of global sea rise, 
could significantly impact global ocean levels if it fully melts. Antarctica is not just a landscape of white. It's also home to the eerie bloodfalls and mysterious green icebergs. Bloodfalls, a crimson waterfall in the McMurdo Dry Valley, is fed by a salty lake trapped under the glacier. The iron-rich water, devoid of oxygen and sunlight, rusts upon contact with air, creating its unique color. Green icebergs, another Antarctic enigma, have puzzled scientists like Stephen Warren for over 30 years. Initially believed to be colored by organic materials, further research suggests iron oxide is the cause. These icebergs, with their high iron content, might play a crucial role in the ocean's nutrient cycle. Antarctica's pre-ice history was teeming with life, including dinosaurs. Fossils of a Triassic iguana-like reptile, the Antarctanax shackletoni, and a massive elasmosaurid, resembling the Loch Ness monster, have been discovered. These finds not only offer a glimpse into Antarctica's lush past, but also provide context for the current biodiversity changes due to global warming. The Ross Ice Shelf, the largest in Antarctica, is known for its mysterious melody. Caused by winds blowing across snow dunes, these surface vibrations create seismic tones, inaudible to humans, but detectable by seismic sensors. This natural song changes in response to environmental factors like melting or storms, offering a novel way to monitor the ice shelf's stability. Contrasting its icy exterior, Antarctica also hosts one of the world's rare lava lakes on Saunders Island. This lake, found in Mount Michael's icy crack, remains molten, with temperatures reaching up to 2,034 degrees Fahrenheit. It's a stark reminder of the dynamic and extreme nature of this continent. Antarctica is no stranger to conspiracy theories, especially when it comes to its unique ice formations. NASA's images of sharp-cornered tabular icebergs spark discussions about their origins. However, these structures are natural, formed by wind and water sculpting the ice. The formation of tabular icebergs begins with the slow flow of glaciers or ice sheets, which are vast accumulations of snow and ice over land. These glaciers move gradually towards the coast under their own weight and the influence of gravity. When these ice masses reach the ocean, they often extend beyond the coastline, floating on the seawater, thus forming ice shelves. Over time, stress and strain build up within these ice shelves due to a combination of factors. These include the constant flow of the glacier feeding into the shelf, the temperature variations within the ice, the movement of the ocean beneath the shelf, and the natural bending and flexing of the ice shelf. This stress leads to the formation of crevasses and cracks on the surface of the ice shelf. Eventually, when the stress exceeds the ice's strength, a large section breaks off or carves from the edge of the shelf, a process akin to snapping a thin bar of chocolate. This carving results in the birth of an iceberg. When the carving occurs on a large, flat ice shelf, the resulting iceberg tends to have a flat top and steep, nearly vertical sides, thus giving it a tabular shape. NASA's involvement in Antarctica includes mapping hidden lakes beneath the ice sheet. Using satellites like IceSat-2, scientists have discovered new subglacial lakes, revealing how these hidden water systems influence ice flow and ocean circulation. The discovery of microbial life in Antarctica's subglacial lakes like Lake Mercer challenges our understanding of life in extreme environments. These findings, showing bacterial cells thriving in sunless, frigid waters, open new possibilities for life on other planets like Mars. Polynias, vast openings in the ice, are a puzzle. They release deep ocean heat into the atmosphere, potentially impacting climate patterns both within and outside Antarctica. Understanding these phenomena is crucial in assessing their role in climate change. Antarctica's role in space exploration is highlighted by the discovery of stardust in meteorites found on its surface. These ancient grains, older than the solar system, offer insights into the universe's past and the formation of planets. As we conclude our journey through the mysteries of Antarctica, it's clear that this continent is more than just a frozen expanse. It's a key to understanding our planet's history, climate dynamics, and even the possibilities of life in extreme conditions. From its ancient rainforests to its singing ice shelves, Antarctica continues to reveal secrets that not only shed light on the past, but also shape our understanding of the Earth's future. We'd love to hear what you find most fascinating about Antarctica. Share your thoughts in the comments below and let's continue exploring this incredible continent together.